everyone, I hope you're all well. Um, today I'm going to be doing a haul video for you. I know a lot of people have been asking for a haul video. Um, so I did a little bit of shopping. I've been in London the past few days. So I did a little bit of shopping um, around Covent Garden. And then I also got um, some makeup bits and bobs from a blog sale as well. So I'm going to go over some of the things that I bought now. Um, first of all, please excuse my hair. <laughs> Um, I'm kind of on like a no heat thing at the moment, I just, my hair is feeling a little bit dry and um, I just wanted to sort of stay away from straighteners and curling irons for a little while and just give my hair a little bit of a break so it can recover. Um, so I've just like put some curling mousse in it and literally just let it dry itself. Um, so this is my little lion's mane that we've got going on at the moment, <laughs> so just ignore the hair. Okay, so let's move on to the haul video. The first place that I went was Aldo. And I actually got a watch, which I'll show you. It's a little watch with a difference. Um, it comes like this, and it's got the most gorgeous face on it. I love the face. They had, um, I think, four to choose from. There was um, a silver one, a larger gold one with sort of really big numbers. And then um, I think it was like a pinky one. Um, I can't quite remember but anyway they all came with different straps and basically what you do is you can I don't know if you can see but on the actual face you can remove it and put it onto any of these straps and this was um, £28 which I think is quite good actually because um, the watch face does look really expensive and I love this sort of tan brown colour and then you get a black and a white and um, the flower straps which are sort of like Kath um, which are really nice. So I got that and I absolutely love it. Um, I'm glad I got that actually. So that's from Aldo. You can also, if you go in there and have a look for them, um, you can look at all the different variations of the straps. And there's some really nice ones. I then went to Accessorize. And um, I actually got a necklace that I'm wearing at the moment. If I just zoom in for you. So I always wear this gold um, sideways cross in all of my videos. Um, I got it from an Etsy seller. Um, one of the, I think Lollipop26 was the first person to buy it and then um, I got mine from an Etsy seller, the same one that she did. I can't quite remember the name of it right now but I'll put it in the description box because I know a lot of people have been asking recently. So I got that. And then this is a new one that I got from Accessorize and it's actually like a little leaf and it was £5. And I just really like it to layer with this one that I wear every day, so I got that. And then I went to H&M. I got a couple of sort of basic tops. They're all really creased because obviously they've been in the bag, but I'll show you them. This is the first one that I got. And this was only £7.99. And it's sort of got this ruched detailing at the front. And then um, it actually is sort of like tight around your body and then the sleeves are loose. So I really do like that for summer. Um, and if you want to see pictures of me wearing all the things that I'm showing, then there'll be photographs on my blog. I'm going to be writing a blog post straight after I've uploaded this video, so I'll link you to that. And then I got this top, which I've actually seen a couple of people in. It looks like this, and this one was $9.99, and it's sort of like a nude silk top, and then it's got black straps and black buttons down the front. So, I like that as well. And then, we've got, we've got a cardigan, just because I kind of needed a couple of new cardigans, because all mine are sort of looking a bit tatty because I've had them a while so I got this one it's just a long cream cardigan um, and it says that it's organic cotton and this was $14.99 just a basic cardigan like that and then lastly I got another top I absolutely love this one and um, this was $14.99 and it looks like this it's like it's got these big loose balloon sleeves and then um, it's elasticated here and also on the bottom and around the neck and then it's got a little burr with um, bronze beads on the bottom so 
so I just thought that was really nice for sort of over the summer. So that's everything I got from the shops and then I'll show you the things that I got in my blog sale now. I can't quite remember the name of the blog that I bought these from so I'm really sorry but I will also link that in the description box as always. So I got this Too Faced palette and it's called the Leopard Love um, Complexion Perfection Kit and it comes with a bronzer, a blusher and a highlighter. It comes in the most loveliest packaging and um, you get these powders and a mirror. Um, so I'll swatch those on my blog as well for you and it comes with a little thing on the back like that to tell you what to do with them. Then I got um, a lipstick from Illamasqua. This is in the colour Sonnet. Now this is really, really nude. It looks more of um, a peachy neutral colour when I saw it in the blog. But in real life it's really, really nude. Like concealer lips. I've got it on now but I got a bit of um, a dark pink lip gloss over the top just so it's not so um, like concealer lips. <laughs> so um, this is a matte lipstick and it's sort of a peachy, peachy nude colour which I'll swatch on my blog as well. Then I got um, a MAC blusher and this is called Rapstein 2 and it's one of the memorialised blushes. I can't remember the collection that this came out with but um, it's just a gorgeous shimmery peach and pink merged blusher and wearing that today it gives you a really nice highlight and um, sheen on your cheeks. And then um, I got a cream colour base in Tickle Me Pink which looks like this. Now I'm not sure why this isn't in cream blusher form and it's classed as a cream colour base instead but I've been using it as a cream blusher um, and it's just this gorgeous pink colour um, it's sort of um, a mix between a cool and a warm pink it's not like uber like Barbie pink but then it is very very pigmented um, and you can actually wear it on your lips as well Um, so I really do like that. Again, swatches will be on my blog. And then, she also threw in this little palette for me, which is a number 7 um, limited edition palette. And it's called the Anniversary Compact. Um, a celebration of our collection and very best loved, most flattering colours. And that one looks like this. It comes with a mirror and a little applicator. And you get this lovely shimmery blusher, which is a pe very pale pink. Then you get a green and a blue eyeshadow and two lip glosses. So that's a really nice little palette as well. So that's everything that I got um, for this little shopping trip. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. And I will see you on Monday with a makeup tutorial. Let me know if you have any requests for what to do. Um, I don't know whether you want something like a spring trend look or a celebrity inspired makeup. Um, just let me know and then I can get that filmed for Monday. I hope you're all doing well and I'll see you on my next video. Bye!